Total Consecration to Jesus Through Mary Hello, and welcome, brothers and sisters in Christ. We are a family here that will help you pray the Holy Rosary and more. Please subscribe now and click on the bell icon, so that you'll receive all of our new uploads. Today we'll pray and meditate. The Day 29 of the 33-Day Method of Prayer and Meditation According to St. Louis Delaware Montfort's Total Consecration to Jesus Through Mary If you haven't watched the previous days, please check them out. We'll add it in the description box below. Purpose, Obtain Knowledge of Jesus Christ During this period we shall apply ourselves to the study of Jesus Christ. What is to be studied in Christ? First the God-man, His grace and glory. Then His rights to sovereign dominion over us. Since, after having renounced Satan and the world, we have taken Jesus Christ for our Lord. What next shall be the object of our study? His exterior actions and also His interior life. Namely, the virtues and acts of His Sacred Heart. His association with Mary in the mysteries of the Annunciation and Incarnation. During his infancy and hidden life. At the Feast of Cana and on Calvary. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty. Creator of heaven and earth. And in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Litany of the Holy Spirit Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Father All-Powerful, have mercy on us. Jesus, Eternal Son of the Father, Redeemer of the world, save us. Spirit of the Father and the Son, boundless life of both, sanctify us. Holy Trinity, hear us. Holy Spirit, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, enter our hearts. Holy Spirit, who art equal to the Father and the Son, enter our hearts. Promise of God the Father, have mercy on us. Ray of heavenly light, have mercy on us. Author of all good, have mercy on us. Source of heavenly water, have mercy on us. Consuming fire, have mercy on us. Ardent charity, have mercy on us. Spiritual unction, have mercy on us. Spirit of love and truth, have mercy on us. Spirit of wisdom and understanding, have mercy on us. Spirit of counsel and fortitude, have mercy on us. Spirit of knowledge and piety, have mercy on us. Spirit of the fear of the Lord, have mercy on us. Spirit of grace and prayer, have mercy on us. Spirit of peace and meekness, have mercy on us. Spirit of modesty and innocence, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit, the Comforter, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit, the Sanctifier, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit, who governs the Church, have mercy on us. Gift of God the Most High, 
have mercy on us. Spirit who fills the universe, have mercy on us. Spirit of the adoption of the children of God, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit, inspire us with horror of sin. Holy Spirit, come and renew the face of the earth. Holy Spirit, shed thy light into our souls. Holy Spirit, engrave thy law in our hearts. Holy Spirit, inflame us with the flame of thy love. Holy Spirit, open to us the treasures of thy graces. Holy Spirit, teach us to pray well. Holy Spirit, enlighten us with thy heavenly inspirations. Holy Spirit, lead us in the way of salvation. Holy Spirit, grant us the only necessary knowledge. Holy Spirit, inspire in us the practice of good. Holy Spirit, grant us the merits of all virtues. Holy Spirit, make us persevere in justice. Holy Spirit, be our everlasting reward. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, send us thy Holy Spirit. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, pour down into our souls the gifts of the Holy Spirit. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, grant us the spirit of wisdom and piety. Come, Holy Spirit. Fill the hearts of thy faithful. And enkindle in them the fire of thy love. Let us pray. Grant, O merciful Father, that thy divine Spirit may enlighten, inflame and purify us. That he may penetrate us with his heavenly dew and make us fruitful in good works. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, thy Son, who with thee, in the unity of the same Spirit, lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Today's reading. Matthew 26 verses 1 to 25. The plot against Jesus. When Jesus had finished saying all these things, he said to his disciples, as you know, the Passover is two days away. And the Son of Man will be handed over to be crucified. Then the chief priests and the elders of the people assembled in the palace of the high priest, whose name was Caiaphas. And they schemed to arrest Jesus secretly and kill him. But not during the festival, they said. Or there may be a riot among the people. Jesus anointed at Bethany. While Jesus was in Bethany in the home of Simon the leper, a woman came to him with an alabaster jar of very expensive perfume, which she poured on his head as he was reclining at the table. When the disciples saw this, they were indignant. Why this waste? they asked. This perfume could have been sold at a high price. And the money given to the poor. Aware of this, Jesus said to them, why are you bothering this woman? She has done a beautiful thing for me. The poor you will always have with you, but you will not always have me. When she poured this perfume on my body, she did it to prepare me for burial. Truly I tell you, wherever this gospel is preached throughout the world, what she has done will also be told, in memory of her. Judas agrees to betray Jesus. Then one of the twelve, the one called Judas Iscariot, went to the chief priests and asked, What are you willing to give me if I deliver him over to you? So they counted out for him thirty pieces of silver. From then on Judas watched for an opportunity to hand him over. The Last Supper On the first day of the festival of unleavened bread, the disciples came to Jesus and asked, where do you want us to make preparations for you to eat the Passover? He replied, Go into the city to a certain man and tell him. The teacher says, My appointed time is near. I am going to celebrate the Passover with my disciples at your house. So the disciples did as Jesus had directed them and prepared the Passover. When evening came, Jesus was reclining at the table with the twelve. And while they were eating, he said, Truly I tell you, one of you will betray me. They were very sad and began to say to him one after the other, Surely you don't mean me, Lord. Jesus replied, 
the one who has dipped his hand into the bowl with me will betray me. The Son of Man will go just as it is written about him. But woe to that man who betrays the Son of Man. It would be better for him if he had not been born. Then Judas, the one who would betray him, said, Surely you don't mean me, Rabbi. Jesus answered, You have said so. The Imitation of Christ Book 4 Chapter 1 On the deep reverence with which Christ should be received. What is the meaning of this kind invitation? Unaware of any good in me on which I may presume, how shall I dare to come? How shall I invite you into my house, who have so often done evil in your sight? The angels and archangels do you reverence. Saints and holy men stand in awe of you, yet you say, Come you all to me. Unless you yourself had said it, who would believe it true? And who would dare approach, unless it were your command? Noah, a good man, is said to have worked a hundred years. To build the ark so that he and a few others might be saved. How, then, can I in one short hour prepare myself? To receive with reverence the Creator of the world. Moses, your great servant, and special friend, constructed an ark of imperishable wood, and covered it with the purest gold, in order to house the tablets of the law. And how shall I, a corruptible creature, dare so lightly to receive you, the maker of the law and giver of life? Solomon, the wisest of Israel's kings, spent seven years building a splendid temple in praise of your name. For eight days he kept the feast of its dedication, and offered a thousand peace offerings. To the sound of trumpets, he solemnly and joyfully bore the ark of the covenant to its appointed resting place. How, then, shall I, unworthiest and poorest of men, welcome you into my house, when I can hardly spend half an hour devoutly? If only I could spend even half an hour as I ought. Zero my God, how earnestly did all these strive to please you. Litany to the Most Holy Name of Jesus Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God the Father of Heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of the living God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Splendor of the Father, have mercy on us. Jesus, Brightness of Eternal Light, have mercy on us. Jesus, King of Glory, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of Justice, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of the Virgin Mary, have mercy on us. Jesus, Most Amiable, have mercy on us. Jesus, Most Admirable, have mercy on us. Jesus, the Mighty God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Father of the World to Come, have mercy on us. Jesus, Angel of Great Counsel, have mercy on us. Jesus, Most Powerful, have mercy on us. Jesus, Most Patient, have mercy on us. Jesus, Most Obedient, have mercy on us. Jesus, Meek and Humble of Heart, have mercy on us. Jesus, Lover of Chastity, have mercy on us. Jesus, Our Lover, have mercy on us. Jesus, God of Peace, have mercy on us. Jesus, Author of Life, have mercy on us. Jesus, Model of Virtues, have mercy on us. Jesus, Zealous for Souls, have mercy on us. Jesus, Our God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Our Refuge, have mercy on us. Jesus, Father of the Poor, have mercy on us. Jesus, Treasure of the Faithful, have mercy on us. Jesus, Good Shepherd, have mercy on us. Jesus, True Light, 
have mercy on us. Jesus, eternal wisdom, have mercy on us. Jesus, infinite goodness, have mercy on us. Jesus, our way and our life, have mercy on us. Jesus, joy of the angels, have mercy on us. Jesus, King of the Patriarchs, have mercy on us. Jesus, Master of the Apostles, have mercy on us. Jesus, Teacher of the Evangelists, have mercy on us. Jesus, Strength of Martyrs, have mercy on us. Jesus, Light of Confessors, have mercy on us. Jesus, Purity of Virgins, have mercy on us. Jesus, Crown of All Saints, have mercy on us. Be merciful, spare us, O Jesus. Be merciful, graciously spare us, O Jesus. From all evil, deliver us, O Jesus. From all sin, deliver us, O Jesus. From your wrath, deliver us, O Jesus. From the snares of the devil, deliver us, O Jesus. From the spirit of fornication, deliver us, O Jesus. From everlasting death, deliver us, O Jesus. From the neglect of your inspirations, deliver us, O Jesus. Through the mystery of your holy incarnation, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your nativity, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your infancy, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your most divine life, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your labors, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your agony and passion, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your cross and dereliction, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your sufferings, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your death and burial, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your resurrection, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your ascension, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your institution of the Most Holy Eucharist, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your joys, deliver us, O Jesus. Through your glory, deliver us, O Jesus. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, spare us, O Jesus. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Jesus. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy on us, O Jesus. Jesus, hear us. Jesus, graciously hear us. Lord Jesus Christ, you have said. Ask and you shall receive. Seek and you shall find. Knock and it shall be opened to you. Mercifully attend to our supplications. And grant us the grace of your most divine love. That we have loved you with all our hearts. And in all our words and actions. And never cease to praise you. Make us, O Lord, to have a perpetual fear and love of your holy name. For you never fail to govern those whom you establish in your love. You, who live and reign forever and ever. Ave Maristella. Hail, O star of the ocean. God's own mother blessed. Ever sinless virgin. Gate of heaven ly rest. Taking that sweet Ave. Which from Gabriel came. Peace confirm within us. Changing Eve's name. Break the sinner's fetters. Make our blindness day. Chase all evils from us. For all blessings pray. Show thyself a mother. May the word divine. Born for us thine infant. Hear our prayers through thine. Virgin all excelling. Mildest of the mild. Free from guilt preserve us. Meek and undefiled. Keep our life all spotless. Make our way secure. Till we find in Jesus. Joy forevermore. Praise to God the Father. Honor to the Son. In the Holy Spirit. Be the glory one, Amen. True Devotion to the Blessed Virgin our good master stooped to enclose himself in the womb of the Blessed Virgin. 
a captive but loving slave, and to make himself subject to her for thirty years. As I said earlier, the human mind is bewildered. When it reflects seriously upon this conduct of incarnate wisdom, he did not choose to give himself in a direct manner. To the human race though he could easily have done so. He chose to come through the Virgin Mary. Thus he did not come into the world independently. Of others in the flower of his manhood. But he came as a frail little child dependent. On the care and attention of his mother. Consumed with the desire to give glory to God, his father. And save the human race, he saw no better or shorter way to do so than by submitting completely to Mary. He did this not just for the first eight, ten, or fifteen years of his life like other children, but for thirty years. He gave more glory to God, his Father, during all those years of submission and dependence, than he would have given by spending them working miracles, preaching far and wide, and converting all mankind. Otherwise, he would have done all these things. What immeasurable glory then do we give to God when, following the example of Jesus, we submit to Mary, with such a convincing and well-known example before us? Can we be so foolish as to believe that there is a better and shorter way of giving God glory than by submitting ourselves to Mary, as Jesus did? Litany of the Sacred Heart of Jesus Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God the Father of Heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world. God the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, Son of the Eternal Father, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, formed by the Holy Spirit in the Virgin Mother's womb, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, substantially united to the Word of God, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, of infinite majesty, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, Holy Temple of God, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, Tabernacle of the Most High, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, House of God and Gate of Heaven, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, Glowing Furnace of Charity, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, Vessel of Justice and Love, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, Full of Goodness and Love, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, abyss of all virtues, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, most worthy of all praise, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, King and center of all hearts, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, in whom are all the treasures of wisdom and knowledge, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, in whom dwells all the fullness of the Godhead, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, in whom the Father was well pleased, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, of whose fullness we have all received, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, desire of the everlasting hills, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, patient and rich in mercy, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, rich to all who call upon you, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, Fount of life and holiness, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, propitiation for our offenses, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, overwhelmed with reproaches, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, bruised for our iniquities, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, obedient even unto death, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, pierced with a lance, have mercy on us. Have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, source of all consolation, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, our life and resurrection, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, 
our peace and reconciliation, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, victim for our sins, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, salvation of those who hope in you, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, hope of those who die in you, have mercy on us. Heart of Jesus, delight of all saints, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Jesus, meek and humble of heart, make our hearts like unto thine. Almighty and eternal God, look upon the heart of thy most beloved Son, and upon the praises and satisfaction, which he offers thee in the name of sinners, and to those who implore thy mercy. In thy great goodness, grant forgiveness. In the name of the same Jesus Christ, thy Son, who livest and reignest with thee forever and ever, Amen. Act of Contrition O my God, I am heartily sorry for having offended thee. And I detest all my sins because of thy just punishments. But most of all because they offend thee, my God. Who art all good and deserving of all my love. I firmly resolve with the help of thy grace to sin no more. And to avoid the near occasion of sin, Amen. Act of Charity O oh my God, I love you above all things. With my whole heart and soul. Because you are all good and worthy of all my love. I love my neighbor as myself for the love of you. I forgive all who have injured me. And ask pardon of all whom I have injured, Amen. Adoramus te. We adore thee, most holy Lord Jesus Christ. Here and in all thy churches that are in the whole world. And we bless thee. Because of thy holy cross thou hast redeemed the world, Amen. St. Louis Delaware Montfort's Prayer to Jesus O most loving Jesus, deign to let me pour forth my gratitude before thee. For the grace thou hast bestowed upon me. In giving me to thy holy mother through the devotion of holy bondage. That she may be my advocate in the presence of thy majesty and my support in my extreme misery. Alas, O Lord! I am so wretched that without this dear mother I should be certainly lost. Yes, Mary is necessary for me at thy side, and everywhere that she may appease thy just wrath, because I have so often offended thee, that she may save me from the eternal punishment of thy justice, which I deserve. That she may contemplate thee, speak to thee, pray to thee, approach thee, and please thee. That she may help me to save my soul and the souls of others. In short, Mary is necessary for me that I may always do thy holy will. And seek thy greater glory in all things. Ah, would that I could proclaim throughout the whole world. The mercy that thou hast shown to me. Would that everyone might know I should be already damned were it not for Mary. Would that I might offer worthy thanksgiving for so great a blessing. Mary is in me. Oh, what a treasure! Oh, what a consolation! And shall I not be entirely hers? Oh, what ingratitude! My dear Saviour, send me death rather than such a calamity. For I would rather die than live without belonging entirely to Mary with St. John the Evangelist at the foot of the cross. I have taken her a thousand times for my own, and as many times have given myself to her. But if I have not yet done it as thou, dear Jesus, dost wish, I now renew this offering as thou dost desire me to renew it. And if thou sayest in my soul or my body, anything that does not belong to this august princess, I pray thee to take it and cast it far from me. For whatever in me does not belong to Mary is unworthy of thee. O Holy Spirit, grant me all these graces. 
Plant in my soul the tree of true life, which is Mary. Cultivate it and tend it so that it may grow. And blossom and bring forth the fruit of life in abundance. O Holy Spirit, give me great devotion to Mary, thy faithful spouse. Give me great confidence in her maternal heart and an abiding refuge in her mercy. So that by her thou mayest truly form in me Jesus Christ. Great and mighty, unto the fullness of his perfect age. Amen. Concluding Prayer O Jesus, living in Mary, come and live in your servants, in the spirit of holiness, in the fullness of your power, in the perfection of your ways, in the truth of your virtues, in the communion of your mysteries. Rule over every adverse power, in your spirit, for the glory of the Father, Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end, Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Thanks a lot, dear brothers and sisters. We hope that you learn in today's video. May our Mother Mary always be by our side. And let her mercy upon us and of the world. If you enjoyed Day 29 of the Total Consecration to Jesus through Mary, we invite you to like it and share this video with others who may want to consecrate themselves one day. And don't forget to subscribe now and click on the bell icon so that you'll receive all of our new uploads. We look forward to praying with you again, on the 30th day of the total consecration. God willing, we'll see each other again, God bless you all.